Hello, Calvary family. I hope you guys are having a great week. Um, I hope you're enjoying the beautiful snow outside and that you're staying in and staying warm. Um, I just want to take a few moments to recap Pastor Yuki's message and reflect on um, some things that really stuck out to me. You know, as I thought about it over the past few days, um, one thing that really stuck out to me was how she highlighted both Moses and Mary's faithfulness in God's call. You know, and when you look at the story of Moses, you can see God's hand was on him throughout his whole life. Um, but he still did not hesitate to accept God's call um, and to lead the Israelites. And, you know, the same can be said about Mary when you look at her and how she had the angel appear to her and tell her this great news that probably would have been overwhelming and it probably would have been looked down upon in her culture but she was still willing to accept that call and she was willing to be faithful in that moment and you know it just always strikes me when i read over the christmas story at how mary was faithful um, and because she was so faithful and so willing to be used by god that god used her to bring his son and to be the parent of jesus and one verse that always sticks out to me is in Luke chapter 1. It's right after the angel comes to her and is explained to her that she's going to be um, the mother of Jesus and that she's going to have a son and all of that. Um, and Mary asks a few questions and then finally in verse 38 she gets to her final answer. And she says, I'm the Lord's servant, Mary answered. May your word to me be fulfilled. Then the angel left her. So this was, when you read this full account, you can see that Mary had to think about it for a second. She had to process it. But then she gets to the point where she fully accepts it. And it doesn't take her that long. You know, in the, in the Bible, we see all the time where people and had to really think about it, had to be shown signs and things like that, that it was God working in their life. But Mary just needed a few moments, just needed a few questions to be answered. And then the angel was able to move on and she accepted the will of God for her. And I think it's very cool um, to look at people in the Bible um, and how God was able to use them and how they're willing to be used by God. And, you know, as we go through the Bible engagement, it's really interesting to see all these different people and all these uh, patriarchs of the faith that really had to accept God's call on their life and had to be willing to step out in faith. And I'm looking forward over the next year to be able to uh, really look at each of those people as we go through uh, the Bible and as we continue on our journey. And Moses and Mary are just two great examples of that. Um, I hope you guys have a great rest of your week and that you continue to let God work in your life and be willing to let him use you in any situation um, for his glory. Um, enjoy the snow and have a great rest of the week. I'll see you Sunday.